Pythagoras was born sometime between 600 and 590 BCE. His father was Menexarchus, an international merchant from Samos, a Greek island in the Aegean Sea, and his mother was Parthenus, a Greek Apollonian. While traveling abroad near Delphi in Greece, Parthenus requested Menexarchus visit the oracle to Apollo. The oracle informed the couple Parthenus was pregnant with a male child and instructed them to abstain from relations during the pregnancy. Parthenus changed her name to Pythesis, but no record exists of her surviving the birth of her son, Pythagoras. Pythagoras traveled extensively with his father, Menexarchus, during his formative years, and Menexarchus raised Pythagoras into the Median Persian cult of Zoroaster, the prophet and son of Ahura Mazda, the god of light. It is widely believed that Pythagoras was also initiated into the other religious cults of his day in all the lands he and his father traveled. These included, according to some, the Eleusinian mysteries of the Attica Peninsula, the Egyptian mysteries of Thebes, the Babylonian mysteries in Chaldea, and the cult of Adonis in Syria. Some believe it was from the Babylonian priestcraft while a prisoner in Chaldea that Pythagoras studied the theorem that he would later become most famous for inventing, the theorem for all right triangles that a squared plus b squared equals c squared. Although the cause and date of his father's death remain unknown, it is recorded that Pythagoras himself traveled as far east as modern Afghanistan, where the Brahmins of Elephanta and Ellora in Hindustan called him Yavanshara, the Ionian teacher. Pythagoras finally settled in Samos, his father's home, where he lived until the age of about 35 under the rule of the tyrant Polycrates. Around the year 550 BCE, Pythagoras went into self-exile from Samos and founded a University of Mathematics in Croton, Italy, where he lived and taught for around 20 years. By about age 55, Pythagoras' school had gained significant enough political influence in the Council of 1000 who ruled Croton, that when one of their politicians, history records his name as Cylon, although this is only a pseudonym for the younger mathematician Hippasus, refused to communalize his property, his discovery of the square root of two, to the cult of Pythagoras, and was thus rejected from cult membership, thrown off a boat to be exact, Hippasus appealed to the Council of 1000 to have Pythagoras tried for criminal conspiracy against the state. Pythagoras fled Croton somewhere between 530 and 495 BCE, narrowly escaping a fire set by Hippasus in a mob at Pythagoras' wife Milo's house with his disciples Archippus and Lysus. He fled from there to Regium, Italy, a port town near the island of Sicily where he parted with Archytas of Tarentum, another disciple, and from there set sail to Metapontum in northeast Italy, the hometown of Hippasus, his would-be assassin, and took refuge in the temple there. He lived on sea cucumbers and honey until he eventually died of starvation in about 494 BCE at around the age of 100 years. <laughs>